All right, this routine is gonna be another ladder type of routine. I'm gonna be incorporating pull-ups, push-ups, and squats. So I'm starting from one, I'm gonna go up to 10, and I'm gonna come back down to one with pull-ups. With push-ups, I'm gonna do times two, and with squats, I'm gonna do times three. Um, now when I go one to 10, I'm gonna do overhand pull-ups, and then on my way back down, um, I'm going to do 10 to 1. I'm going to do those underhand. That way I'm getting the biceps in as well. So this is uh, really a good overall uh, full body workout incorporating the pull-up bar. We're getting in uh, back, buys uh, with the pull-ups and the uh, curl-ups coming down. Uh, we're getting in the chest and the tries with our push-ups and our shoulders and we're also incorporating in our legs also with the squats. So it's a good full body uh, ladder type routine. So let's get going.
The beast workout, we just did 110 pull-ups, 55 overhand, 55 underhand. We did uh, 220 push-ups and 330 squats. I think all that we got in probably 20 minutes. Now granted, I was cruising and was trying not to take uh, so much rest in between, but don't worry about my time. Don't worry about your time. Worry about getting the workout completed. And then after you complete your workout, make note of your time. And then the next time you come around and do it, time yourself again. This is a good workout to do every couple weeks, right? Um, it's not a workout I do uh, certainly not every day. I don't even do it every week. But I do it about every other week or whatever, once a month. It's a good workout to mix things up. You can see you're, you're gonna be building muscle and it's a good cardio workout too, right? I mean, I got a pretty good sweat going, you're gonna sweat and you're gonna get your heart rate up and you're gonna burn fat doing this at the same time. Um, make sure you're hydrating before your workouts, during and after, okay? BCAAs, they're important. If you don't know what they are, research them because they're a very important um, aspect and variable in your performance um, and your recuperation, okay? So make sure you implement those as well. Um, and remember, you don't have to do the pyramid style workout or the ladder workout with these exercises. You can mix up and do whatever um, exercises you want. This is just another tool for you to put in your toolbox and um, use it play with it, uh, do whatever you want with it. But anyways, I hope you got something out of it and uh, see you next time.